Salaam, my name is Mehpo Bawa. I've been the host of Living Ramadan season two for the past 10 days, the past 10 episodes or nights, I should say. I want to thank each and every one of you for watching the program, for providing with some wonderful feedback. And I want to take this opportunity as we end off the season and as we celebrate the day of Eid today, I want to say a big, big shukran and a thank you to each and every organization, every individual for allowing us to take a peek into their lives, for allowing us to share their story and the good work that they are doing in the community with each and every one of you. We are certainly indebted to some uh, very important people, Ahmad Jacobs and uh, Hussein Sable and the team at Market Toyota for keeping us mobile during the production of the series. We certainly owe them a huge debt of gratitude. There are many other people like Faisal Sayed and his team at Dean TV for collaborating with us on this production and allowing us an opportunity and a platform to showcase and bring you Living Ramadan Season 2. The unsung heroes behind the camera, the gentleman is Ray and he's been our cameraman and editor and doing this absolutely sterling job and his attention to detail has been absolutely magnificent. We really uh, are hugely indebted to him for the work that he's done. My wife, Rezia Bawa, how do I forget her? It's under her auspices, the company Rezia Bawa Productions, that we produce this episode uh, for the Living Ramadan Season 2 and having been able to bring this to you. Other people that I'd like to thank personally, Malika Omar from Dubai in Cape Town, back in her hometown. She's a composer of music of note and uh, she allowed us to use uh, her musical clips on uh, the show and we thank you Malika for allowing us to do that and uh, also to Siraj uh, Nur Mohammed for the graphic design of the logo and then the Dean TV team the graphic design team for animating that logo as well everybody else has been a part of our production we had a production intern uh, Rosina uh, Hendricks uh, for being with us and I hope she's learned a little bit about film production and TV production while she spent time with us as well but more importantly through the stories that we shared on our our show through these stories that we had of individuals and organizations and not just organizations we shared a couple of organizations but more importantly just people ordinary people like you and I who are doing amazing work during the month of Ramadan but even beyond Ramadan we're sitting in sitting we are standing right here in a ma magnificent backdrop earlier you saw Table Mountain and behind me the city of Cape Town a beautiful absolutely magnificent city that's been described by many people as heaven on earth but we face serious challenges in the city as well uh, there is a great divide between poor and middle class and the rich and we are trying to bridge that gap uh, uh, as quickly as we possibly can and the individuals that we featured into this year's season and other people like them are doing great work to be able to do some charitable work uh, amongst community and to ensure that those who don't have have uh, all of the time not just during Ramadan so the good work that they do they carry on throughout the year and may they inspire us to also do good work like this as well today is the day of Eid it is there to get as we celebrate as we come to the end of Ramadan and I've ended off always by wishing you peace and blessings and I'll do so again but I think importantly on a day like Eid we should remind ourselves that it's so important to surround ourselves with people who will uplift inspire and motivate us to live our best life and in the same way we should lead by example and be that person for others as well so today on Eid my message to each and every one of you is to surround yourself with people who love you who inspire you be that person for others let your let your family and friends know that you appreciate having them in your life, that you cherish each and every moment with them and that you certainly will be with them as often as you can and on this day of Eid I hope you are able to spend this day in their company. Let them know that you love, appreciate and adore them and that you do love them dearly. I wish you peace, blessings, salams. I love you all.